What do you do when you have a tween? They're starting to stink. I have boy girl twins, so it's I have this laboratory just exploding at all times. Right so, before your right eyes. Right before my eyes. They need deodorant, but you're afraid to tell them? I know what I do. Hey, isn't it time to shower? I think also you, you hearken back to that time when you were that one in grade school that stunk and you're like, oh God, I wish my mom would have told me I stunk. What's a parent to do? Well, first thing you want to be careful not to do is you shame, guilt, humiliation, embarrassment, okay? They might feel those things as a result of the discussion. That's, that's part of the human experience. But when you use it as a weapon, it surrounds that whole thing with something that really doesn't become the learning experience you want it to be. You have tweens. Twin, yeah, twin, twin, twins. Twin tweens. Twin tweens. <laughs> I'm just honest with them, and a lot of times. For so them, what do you say? I say. Like, what do you exactly hey, say? Hey Mia, did you put your deodorant on this morning? So she say, Mom. Now it's cool because she's ten, and so that the scent is just beginning. Um, <laughs> so I think that I think give it a year or two, she's going to be like, oh, yes. But like you know, buying them deodorant is like you go pick it out. It's for you. It's your special thing. You've got a special place in your bathroom you keep all this stuff that you know makes them want to use it more in terms of that conversation right telling her daughter mia mia you gotta have that deodorant <laughs> is that a good thing or, is, or are we embarrassing them you planted a lot of seeds in in their development and growth and you've also given a lot of power to how they've handled things pick out your deodorant things like that mm -hmm. the other thing i do is i'd add to the educational standpoint mm -hmm. When you tell a kid that, you know, you have all these skin cells that are dying on you and you have that oil on there, there are bacteria on your skin that are eating that. And you know what the smell really is? It's bacteria poop. Like, Ew, Dad! And my dad was like, that's oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> You know, but, and, and a lot of kids are like that, but then they go, oh, wow. So then they realize why it's not just that you smell, it's that there is a health issue that you have to be concerned mm -hmm. about and be aware of as you grow older.